Good morning guys. It is day number three here in Samusakam. We will be going to the train market today. Um, so we can't wait for that. I think we're all ready to leave this area. It's really not much to do. It just seems like a place for us to unwind and just relax, get away from the city, which it really is different from Bangkok. Bangkok was just so busy. Everybody was tired, legs were tired. There was a lot of walking. But after being here for a couple of days, I really feel refreshed. I got to spend some time in a gym also over here, which I really didn't get a chance to do that much in Bangkok because we were already doing a lot of walking. So that was pretty much my exercise there. Good morning. Say hi, boo. Hi. How you feel? How was your exercise? Mm, sore. You sore? It's gonna come back a new man. Ready to go at it again today? Jelly, you got your New Zealand jelly. You got the Mangrove Cafe right here. That's where we just had breakfast. You can also come here for lunch, dinner also. It's coming.
somewhere around the area, I would definitely come check it out. Trying to catch the train. Here's the schedule. This is the Mac Long Railway Market. The train passes through the market every few hours. We are right on the train tracks. Some that? dried squid. A squid? No, it looks like fish, maybe. Fish, fish. Fish. I know squid had a fish tail. <laughs> Must be a different species of squid. Oh, that's what I ate. Why didn't you wear your chain? My oh. uh, what? Hmm? Oh, my shirt? Got it on right now. I gotta find me a different beer tank. It's a lot of fish. Fresh meat. Fresh meat. A little butcher shop on the, on the railroad. Fruit, fruit, fruit. After two weeks here in Thailand, guys, we finally found it! Durian smoothie for Miss Queen over here. If you guys never had durian, <laughs> I suggest you try it. A lot of people don't really like it because it smells like crap. Yeah, I ain't touching those lips today. <laughs> Got it. Let's taste it. Okay. Fresh durian. Does it taste like ass or does it taste like... It tastes good. It's sweet and creamy, but it just smells like... Beep. <laughs> ah, yes. Yes. Oh, okay. yes. Yes. This is it. I love the rain. So this is the name of the place. It's called the... Punjong coffee at smoothies. As you can see in a picture, it's a railway, a train on our tracks. 
with a lovely smoothie model over here. Can't focus in. There we go. If you guys are searching for the durian smoothie, we found it. It is located on the Mangfong Railway Station. It's probably walked down a good maybe five, ten minutes, and it should be there. Just make sure you look at the menu. Just search for it. Well, there's a guy sitting outside today. I don't know about the other days. Yeah, it's a little hidden spot along the railway. You actually got to make sure you look left and right. I know, I know you're gonna have to look down because you might trip over the stones and stuff, but you can't miss it. It actually looks like a little smoothie shop, like a little nice building, actual building. So yeah, during smoothie guys, on the Mekong Railway Station. Rabbits, birds. That's a pet store. Same experience. You guys made a stop for some Tang beer. As you can see, it's one of my favorites here. Very cheap beer. I like it. Give me a good buzz. All I need is one to help me enjoy my day even more. Coming. <laughs> This guy over here is sore from working out. Yesterday was chest day. <laughs> we got some Thai boat noodles. Very famous dish in Thailand. Uh, it has beef liver, some meatballs, and the broth is made out of um, pork or cow blood mixed with salt and some spices. Train's coming, so everyone's packing up their little store. Pack it up, pack it up. Hop, hop, coming. Clear out, clear out, clear out. That's it guys, that was the, the Mekong Railway Market. I'm gonna end it right here. See you guys in the next province. We are headed to Wuhan. Have some. She stole my beer. Hey guys, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. See you in the next province. Wuhan.
Ah, see you there.